What's up everybody and welcome to Sally Face. Now this game I've been sitting on for ages. Now this isn't actually even a game that I play or I bought for the Steam sale back in October. Um, this is a game that I've had for over a year and never touched it. I have it on my PlayStation and my PC and I never touched it. And we're going to play it today. Episode 1. Um, I heard episode 1 is like 11 hours alone. So this is going to be a long series but I'm, I'm excited for it. I mean I'm hyped for it. I heard this game is really really cool so let's hop into it. It was just like the last time. Only this time, it started in a hospital. Boom, boom. Whoa. Answer phone. Hello? It's okay, Sal. Everything is going to be okay now. Come and see. Who is this? Sal, come and find me. Weird. Sounded like my dad. Push. Question. It looks like something's there, but it's too dark to see. Okay. Light switch. There we go. A key. Hey, a key. What is this? It said X. Oh, okay, that's cool. Why she walk like that? Thor walk. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Thug walk. Hey, blow up. Alright, even... that's enough. That's enough. Uh, there you go. Okay, what the? Okay, this isn't weird at all. I'm so lost. Let's open A, I guess. C? No? Okay. B. Okay, I think it's D. Oh, maybe it's like a code. Okay, D O. I'm killing it. Okay. D O F Frick D O H Dang it Okay D O G Dog Alright Dog walk Hey, blow walk you can't even talk to these people, okay. Speak. Who's a good doggy? Who's a good boy? I buried her alive, kid. You tell me. <laughs> what? Huh? Go see for yourself. Alright. Crazy dog. Diana Fisher. Beloved mother and wife. Okay. I can't get over the thug walk. Battery's not included. It's locked. How the frick? Eight, six. So I could basically just put it in anything. Alright, sweet. Alright. <laughs> Dad? You are not my son. My son is not a murderer. This is your fault. Mom? Are you... Ugly? Sorry. <laughs> and that's when I woke up. Hmm... Yes, it's an interesting dream. I think we should come back to that dream later. But for now, can you tell me more about the body? Which one? The second one, the one from the apartment. Dad and I had just moved in. 
I had a weird feeling about that place right away. Episode 1, Strange Neighbors. Okay. So that was like the introduction. Okay. I'm interested. This will be our new beginning. We can finally leave what happened in New Jersey behind us now. Why don't you go explore the building and make some friends while I finish unpacking? I don't know. I'm trying to give everybody a voice. Oh, now she's really thugging. She's got the boy. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl, but I'm thinking it's a she. Now he's really thug walking. He's got the nice shoes, the everything. Thug walk. Hey, blow up. Alright, that's enough, for real. Okay, bags. Just some stuff Dad got from the store. Nothing important. Okay. Okay, so nothing in there. Dad still has trouble sleeping at night after... After... what? Okay. Sal's room. I see you've made yourself at home already, Gizmo. Must be nice. Okay. Bum, bum. This music's a jam. Dad's room. Okay. Bum, bum. Higido. Decided to take a break from unpacking? That's not a bad idea. We've been at it for a while now. Maybe I'll take a break myself. I miss mom. Yeah. Me too, buddy. Me too. What do you think about this place? It may not be as nice as that old house, but we'll make the best of things. As long as we have each other, I think we can make a real home here. I miss Jersey. I know you do, bud, but please try to give it a chance. School will start up in a couple of weeks and then you'll be able to make all new friends. Yeah, I guess so. I know so. Anyone would be lucky to have you as a friend, so. Thanks, Dad. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. See ya. Try not to get into too much trouble. So he's saying bud. I'm assuming that this is a boy now. Based off him saying bud. Bum bum. Sal's place. Hello. What happened in that room? Police business, kid. Why don't you run along back to your parents? I wish I could. What was that wise ass? Nothing. That's what I thought. Stupid weirdo kid. Ugh. Why are you standing here? I'm protecting nosy little freaks like you. From seeing what they ought to not see. Now scram, I don't get paid to babysit. Who are you? I'm your fairy fucking godmother, what does it look like? I'm an officer of the law, so you better show me some respect. Okay. Let's hop on the elevator. I'm trying to do these voices, but I don't know if I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue to do these voices. Let's go to the first floor. Oh dear, what a frightful, uh, pardon me, let's start over. Hello, young sir, new resident of Addison Apartments, room 402, how may I be of service? How do you know who I am? I know all that takes place in these walls, sir. Y'all, you'll do good to remember that. Can I come in? Heavens no, I'm afraid that I'm quite particular about my privacy, I'm sure you understand. Sure. Goodbye. Farewell, friend. No one's home. What's going on? Hello, young man. You just moved in today, correct? Yes, sir. I already spoke with your father. Seems you two were out of state when everything happened last night. Story checks out. That's good. Try not to get in our way for now, okay? We're investigating a serious crime. Was it murder? I can't talk about that. Bye. So long. Okay. No one's home. Oh my god. 
Yeah, what do you want? A little early for trick-or-treating, isn't it? Uh, stupid good-for-nothing kids. <sighs> okay, a little odd, but all right. So what am I supposed to be doing here? Am I just traveling the, the freaking place? All right, let's go to... I don't even remember what we were on. I think we were on floor five. No one's home. Yeah, who's there? Hello, I'm new in the building. Just wanted to introduce myself to the neighbors. Okay, come in. What the? Hi, my name is Sal. I just moved in with my dad. What the hell is with your face, child? Oh, I know. Young teens, a new generation of self-expression. I was young once myself. I get it. Just so long as you're not in a gang or anything, you're not in a gang, are you? No, no, it's nothing like that. Wonderful. Well, I'm Charlie. Don't mess with my stuff and we'll be okay. I'm a collector. You see, I collect many things. These things are like my family. So if you mess with my collections, you're messing with my family. Got it? Yes, sir. Not a problem. I won't be giving you any trouble. Good to hear. Look. Bask in the glory of my complete set of glitter ponies. A great accomplishment it is to have this full set. You can look all you want, but don't even think about touching them. What's a glitter pony? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> my God, child, have you never seen my glitter ponies? Rainbow Spectacular It is the greatest television show ever produced. It's got drama, action, romance, comedy, everything you could want. And the ponies. Oh, the ponies. Don't even get me started. Mmm, yeah. Um, I guess I missed that one. I'll have to look for it on TV. Yes, you will. Trust me. You won't regret it. Uh, see you later, weird guy. <laughs> no one's home. No one's home. Hmm, I guess no one's home. Why did he... And this must be Weird Guy's apartment. Okay. Yeah, that's Charlie's place. Okay. So, okay. Three. No one's home. Hey. Oh, my. Sorry, you just started me a little. You must be one of the new guys from 402, yeah? With all the excitement going on today, I haven't had a chance to stop and, and say hi. Yeah, it's just me and my dad. My name is Sal. Pleasure to meet y'all. Sal, I'm Lisa. I take care of this place. Keep things up and running. So if you ever need help with anything, don't hesitate to ask, okay? Sure, thanks. You're quite welcome. No one's home. I, I don't remember if I knocked on that place or not. Okay, and I can't go over here. Except it looks like there's something over there. Don't it? Okay. Bum bum. Alright, let's go to room four. Floor four, I mean. Okay, that's the grumpy guy. Oh, that's my place. Hold up. Wait, wait, wait. Did I just screw up? No. Okay, wait. I'm not done exploring yet. No one's home. Okay. Let's go up to the final floor and then we'll see what's up, I guess. Here we go, final floor. <clears throat> this floor is currently being renovated for your safety. Please make your way to the nearest exit. Locks. I don't like this. Oh, this game just... Hello? Sorry, I didn't think anyone lived up here. Hello? Sir, are you okay? You shouldn't have come here. I'm sorry, I was just trying to get to know my new neighbors and... A dark place. This building. Horrible things happen. Are you sure you're okay? Oh. What the? What the? Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. What the? That's weird. The bathroom door is locked. But there's handprints on it. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Locked. 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 Okay. 
Let's get the heck on. Alright, I've explored all the floors. Let's go back home. Let's go back to the crib. Sal's place. Let's go find Dad. What a big dog. Hey, kiddo. See ya. <laughs> Try not to get in too much trouble. Alright, I'm not gonna do the voices no more just because half the time I already forgot some of the voices and what they're supposed to be, so. Okay, what is the goal now? I don't understand. Sleep aid, okay. I don't know what the goal is now, to be honest with you. Um, let's go back to my room. Maybe we got a one pack. Oh, that's not my room. Okay, let's go back in my room. Okay, maybe we got a one pack. I don't know. Oh, I was wondering where that was. Can I? My gear boy looks like it needs new batteries, though. It says goal explore building. But I already explored the building, so I don't. Now I'm confused. Let's go talk to that cop on floor. Well, maybe I guess this floor. Hold on. I'll go back. Shoot. Sure, let's, let's stay on this floor for right now. Let me talk to this cop. Hello. Ugh. Okay. So nothing new to say here. Alright. Um, ground floor. I don't think that cop was on the ground floor, was he? Oh, yeah, he was. Hey, detective. Hello, Sal. So long. Let's talk to Addison, I guess. What is the goal now? I've explored everything, haven't I not? Maybe, uh... Because the only other room I could go into was, uh... Charlie's room? I think it was floor three. Let's uh go to back to Charlie's room. No, it's floor two. And see if we can either find either find some batteries or that key card for the thing. I don't know. Alright, let's go back into Charlie's place. We just waltz right in. So, yep, I know, you're speechless. You've never seen such an awesome collection. Yeah, don't worry. Anytime I'm home, you can stop by and take it all in. Nice place, you guys. It's my own chunk of heaven. Just me and my stuff. Do you live here alone? Alone? Look around you. I have all the company I could ever need. What? It, well, it is nice to have a visitor from time to time, I suppose. Be right back. So, you can only look at those, I guess? I know they're so, yeah, okay. Explore building, I did it! Okay. Question is, where do I get a key card? Maybe on the fifth floor? Maybe, I don't know. Key card locked. Huh, there's a small hole here. Can't really see anything on the other side. Oh! I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. Yeah, I would too. You all know what that hole is. That's where the bathroom door is locked. Okay, I'm just gonna spam click anything and everything, I guess. All right. No wonder this game takes 11 hours. All right, let's see if going home does anything now. Maybe Explore building. What does it mean, explore the building? 
I feel like I've explored everything. <clears throat> I swear, I feel like I've explored everything. Oh, I never finished talking to her. Okay. How long have you been working here? Actually, I don't just work here. I live here too. I'm on all on call 24-7 for any urgent maintenance needs. Despite what you may hear from others, this is a lovely building. I'm happy to call it home. Going on 10 years now. Seems like a nice place. You betcha. What do others say about the building? Oh, all kinds of stuff. I'm sure this building is well over 100 years old, you know. People are always complaining about one thing or another, but you'll hear no complaints from me. I'm a woman of action. If I see a problem, I fix it. Yeah, most people do seem to complain a lot about all the small things. You can't sweat the small stuff, Sal. It's just no way to live, you know? You're right. Take it from me. You focus on the good stuff. Focus on what makes you happy in this life. Put your energy into that. So, do you know anything about what happened in 403? It's a shame you and your dad had this crummy first impression. I promise things aren't typically so gruesome around here. Poor Mrs. Sanderson. Who's Mr. Sanderson? Oh, never mind that. Best not set your mind on such dreadful things. And is there anything to do for fun around here? So you know what? I have a son around your age. I think you two would go get going great. He's downstairs in our apartment. You should go introduce yourself. Sure, I'll go say hi. Great. His name is Larry. He'll be in the basement. Tell him I sent you down. You'll need a key card to access it from the elevator, though. Here, take this one. I've got a few extras. Cool, thanks. Oh, is this building haunted? Sal, sweetie, I've been taking care of the Addison's apartment for a long time and I've never seen any ghosts or goblins. That's just people's overactive imaginations. Too much sweet and scary movies, if you ask me. Sweets and scary movies, if you ask me. Okay, see ya. Okay, that's why. She had the key card. So, now I have the key card. That's all I needed, okay. So now we can insert the key card and go to the basement. <clears throat> Okay, basement's actually kind of sick. Gee, I sure am looking forward to using this. Not. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, lots of tasty junk food. I'm not really hungry, though. What the hell was that? Okay. Bathroom. Okay, their house looks a little too similar to mine. I don't think I like that too much. Keep out. It's locked. Okay. Yeah. Hey, uh, Larry, your mom said I should come say hi. I just moved into 402. Oh, hey, come on in. Doors open. Whoa, nice mask. It's a prosthetic. Oh, shit. Sorry, man. It's cool. I'm used to... Used to much worse by now, so I'm glad you like it. So, do you, like, have no face under there? What happened? I'd rather not talk about that. Okay, change of subject. I'm Larry. I live down here with my mom. I'm Sal. My friends call me Sally Face. I just moved here with my dad from New Jersey. Sally Face? I guess I didn't really have any decent friends, to be honest. So once they started calling me that, I figured if I owned the name, then the assholes couldn't use it against me. You're a complicated dude, aren't you, Sal? You're pretty strange. I like you. We're going to get along great. Huh, that's what your mom said, too. Mother knows best. So why do you live in the basement? Mom always says it's because we got to guard the place from rats, but I'm pretty sure she gets this room rent-free with a maintenance gig. It's cool, though. I don't mind it. I get to listen to music as loud as I want when she's not around. Nice. Yes, yeah, my own like my own little bat cave. I like your shirt. Thanks. It stands for Sally Face. Heh. <laughs> I do have my own clothing line, so uh, it's actually for this metal band called Sanity's Fall. Do you like metal? I don't know. Oh, that's got to change. Check out this song. It's their first single. The full album comes out in a few months. That's Sally getting lit. What happened in 403? Shh, not so loud, man. What? What is it? The killer is still in the building. How do you know that? I saw it happen. Are you high right now? I wish I was, man. This is some scary shit. What happened? 
Okay, so I was helping Miss Sanderson with a clogged toilet. I was just finishing up when I heard him burst in yelling like a lunatic. I know what you've done, Herman. Told me everything, you stupid bitch. She tried to calm him down, but before she could get even a few words out, he was cutting her throat wide open. I was shocked. I couldn't move. I was frozen by fear, man. Just peeking through the crack in the bathroom door. Anyways, it all happened so fast, and then he cleaned up quickly and left. I don't know how, but he didn't even see me. I haven't really told anyone yet, not even my mom, but I trust you. You know who did it? Yeah, it was definitely Charlie, big creeper from 204. He was wearing gloves, so I don't think they got any prints or anything. Shouldn't you tell the cops? I actually tried to talk to that detective, but he won't listen to me without some kind of evidence. Like, my word isn't enough. What's up with the guy in 103? That's Mr. Andis Mr. Addison. He owns this place. I don't think I've ever seen him leave his room. Always talks through his little mail slot. He's a nice dude, just real strange. Oh, yeah, if you see, say Addison T, please, and thank you to him, he'll give you a cup of his famous tea. I hate this stuff myself, but they don't seem to love it. See ya. Get lit, I guess. I don't know. All right. Um, she's still vibing. All right. Talk to Larry in the basement. Did I not just do that? Am I supposed to talk to him again? Right, let's go back to talk to Larry, I guess. I don't know. I like your painting. Thanks, dude. It's my passion. What's this thing? That's a, it's a police scanner. I can listen in on local cop chatter. How the hell did you get this thing? That's a story for another day, but hey, you just gave me a great idea. If I make a fake call, maybe I can distract them long enough for you to sneak into 403. Maybe we can find some kind of evidence to show that detective something they weren't looking for pretty quick to sign me up for the break-in. Well, I gotta make the call down here, and I'm just messing with you. I'm totally up for this. Been wanting to peek in this room anyway. Sweet. So what's the plan? I'll call in a bank robbery hostage situation. That should clear that out with the cost for sure. I'm guessing that'll buy us a few minutes until they figure out it wasn't real gotta be upstairs when I do that so we can make those minutes count we can use my walkie talkies to communicate during the whole thing then I can give you a heads up too once I know the cops are coming back sounds pretty solid to me maybe just switch the bank robbery with armed robbery at like a gas station or drugstore make it a little more believable hmm yeah I guess you're right good call Sally here take this head to your room and let me know when you're ready just press that Y button there to call me okay but okay Sweet, so I'm gonna go up to my room. Or I'm gonna go right outside my room. And then that's gonna be it. Uh room four. Or floor four, not room four. Alrighty. Minus four oh two. So you ready? Gotta get up to my room first. Call me once you get there. Okay, I'm in my room now. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna make a call. Give me a second. Okay. okay, it's done. I heard a bunch of hustling upstairs, so I think it worked. Go see if you can get into room 403 now. Okay. Oh, 403 is this way. Yes, sir. Examine. There's a broken coffee table with some books. Look like anything important. Just looks like junk to me. All right, keep looking then. There's got to be something else. Man, this is pretty twisted. Tell me about it. Oh, there's these little figures. Looks like one is missing. I can see a small clearing in the blood. Hmm, that's it. I know how we can get him. Get out of there and come down to the basement. He collects those things. So maybe he needed it to... You know what I'm saying? Sanderson and Charlie both collected those weird toys. They're nuts over those things. Mr. Sanderson got this super rare one or something. She was telling me about it the day I was fixing her toilet. Anyways, I bet you Charlie couldn't resist taking it. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if that's what he offered her in the first place. That dude always did give me the creeps. There's something unsettling about him, you know? Wow, this is crazy. That guy definitely needs to get caught. We can't live in a building with a murderer. Exactly. That's why you gotta get into Charlie's room and see if you can find that toy. Wait, why do I have to do it? I snuck into room 403. Charlie isn't too fond of me. There's no way he'd let me in. He accused me of stealing snacks. Snacks. Fucking fatty. <laughs> alright, alright. I'll do it. Won't be able to sleep at night otherwise. Cool. You're the man, Sally. Here, take this bag. You can slip the toy in without touching it. Why do I get the feeling you've done this before? Haha, <laughs> nah. I just watch too much TV. All right, let's do it. Let's freaking do it, baby. I think he uh, lives on room, or he's in room two or something, so. Or floor two. I keep saying room. I think he's on floor two. Where do I get out of here from? 
right there. Okay. Here we go. He collects those freaking things. All right. Uh, let's say two, because I think it's two. <laughs> yep. Okay. Sweet. Be right back. Okay. I know they're so cool, aren't they? Yeah. My man. Good luck. Okay. How do I... How do I do it, though? Hmm. Yeah. How do I grab it? Addison T, please and thank you. Yes, coming right up. There you are, sir. Please enjoy. Sweet. Sally face, my man. Good luck. Okay. Bump, 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 bump. All right, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I looked this up because uh, I couldn't figure it out. So you got to take the T. This will knock that fast bastard out for sure. You take the tea and the sleeping pills, right? Oh. See? And then you give it to that fat guy, Charlie. And he's gonna he's gonna sip it and pass the frick out. Then we're gonna finesse the toy. And then I'm gonna end the episode. Is what I'm finna do. So, let's go to Charlie's place. What's good, Charlie, my man? Mm. Okay, be right back. Was that Addison T I smell? Yeah, I just got some from. Oh, I just love Addison T. Give it here. Ah, so tasty, so relaxing. Got an achievement for girls. Got the toy score. Right, we gotta go. Before Fatty wakes up. Okay. Uh, silly face, my man. Good luck. Okay, he didn't even. Sheesh. Um, he's gonna know it's me, is he not? Let's see if the detective's back yet. <gasps> he is. Hey, detective. Hello, Sal. I've got evidence. Let me see that. This came from Charlie's room. How did you get this? I was just saying hello to my new neighbors, you know, trying to induce myself. I was in there talking to Charlie, and he was showing me all of his toys. That's when I noticed one had blood on it. I thought for sure this would be helpful, so I grabbed it with my lunch bag. Well, well, a little detective in training, huh? Haha, <laughs> not bad, kid. I'll hold on to this. Just remember, next time you come to us with this info, instead of putting yourself at risk, okay? Yes, sir, you got it. All right, we did it. All right, that is going to be it for this episode, guys. Um, Oh, there's some other stuff here. Missing sandwich. Picture? I, I don't know. Okay, if you guys want me to continue Sally Face, this game's kind of cool. I mean, I'm not going to lie. It's pretty sick. Um, let me know down below. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell icon. Check out more horror content down below. This game's pretty sick. Um, I'm, I'm probably going to be doing a lot of episodes on this because it is really, really cool. Um, with that being said, guys, um, I'm, I, I'm, I also want to apologize for not uploading a video on Monday. I got really, really far behind with school and work and stuff. And I started going to the gym again because I skipped for a long, I skipped for like two weeks or something like that. So, um, I'm actually going to like pre-record like five or six videos, as many as I can really to get you guys some videos so I can nonstop like be good for you guys. So I'm sorry I missed, um, I'm going to get a lot of those videos out for you. Um, other than that guys, um, let me know how you guys like this video. Check out more horror content down below. Check out my links and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.